It's another match day vlog. The Reds face Brighton away in the League Cup or the EFL Cup, whatever one you want to say. A game in which I'm really not sure how to feel about it. I want to win because I want to win every single game uh, that Liverpool play in. However, I also understand that when we face Brighton like three days after at Anfield in the league, that is much more an important game. Uh, I was hoping that we'd have more players available to us today so we could make many, many changes. Uh, however, we are without quite a key number of players. Diego Jota, uh, no Chiesa. Conor Bradley might be back in contention no Harvey Elliott and obviously no Alison Becker so the rotation up top isn't gonna happen I don't think um I don't think he's got a lot to choose from to be honest so we'll have to see what we put out uh, I believe that we've got a strong enough squad to actually you know beat Brighton but they are a really 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 good side uh love the football that they play love the the way they're set up as a a, a club um so we know it's not going to be easy but I would be prioritizing the league game uh on Saturday at Anfield that is just what I would be doing but that does not mean that we cannot win both hopefully we can uh, before we do get into the match day vlog please do like this video and also subscribe to the channel we are on the road to 50,000 subscribers so i really appreciate every single one of you who do hit that subscribe button but enough for me let's go all the way down to the amex and get back early hours of the morning hopefully with not three points but with a win uh, and going through to the next round It's half time, it is nil nil. Both teams have had a couple of really good chances. Uh, Yaros has made a brilliant save, which then led to a counter attack. Cody Gakpo just went, um, you know, was finished just the wrong side of the post. Uh, as for us, I think we've had a couple of good chances down the left hand side. Made the keeper make one, maybe two all right saves. Uh, but it's not been a riveting game of football, that's for sure. Uh, I think they've had a lot more of the ball. I mean, I'm guessing here. Yeah. Um, we've reduced them to long shots. One of them did wrong foot our goalkeeper um, but yeah you know it's uh, all right first half let's hope we can improve we can make say, changes in the second uh, but let's just hope we have a little bit more energy a little bit more ruthlessness about us and let's see if we can create some more chances <laughs>
the game now. Finish it. No, it's a bad ball. Oh my. Why? Please. Are you just being for real? Why haven't you just finished it on your right foot? I don't know. This time. Yes.
I'm outside the stadium, Liverpool win 3-2, five goals in the second half, uh, a really enjoyable game of football and I get to go home, I get seven hours on a coach, I get to go home in the early hours of the morning but it's all okay because the Reds won and that is all that I could ask for, um, it was a brilliant second half, had a little bit of everything, uh, Cody Gakpo's first goal is an absolute joke, Yaros is an absolute joke, I do not know how we came away with three exceptional keepers, um, that one that he saves onto the post, if Alison Becker does that, I am lost for words. Let me tell you, the third goalkeeper of Liverpool Football Club just did that. Um, it is exceptional. Uh, he did not deserve to concede two, but he did. But it's OK, because Liverpool scored three in the end, and I'm very glad that he had a heroic moment in that game, because he deserved it. He played so, so well. Uh, Curtis Jones was great. Cody Gakpo was great in that second half. Um, I just loved everyone. Joe Game, I thought, was brilliant. And look, that was a rotated team. We still had enough quality in there. But these are some players who don't play week in, week out. Connor Bradley just came back from an injury, I think it was. Um, and you know what? They gave me everything, and that's really all I can ask for. Um, and we came away, not with three points, but with, with, with the win, and we're into the next round. So that is absolutely superb. Uh, thanks for watching. Until the next one, up the Reds.